We've all heard the saying, timing is everything, and this next topic definitely proves it. We all like to ponder the big questions. Are we alone in the universe? Why do we dream? And most importantly, how long should a session last between the sheets? A psychologist from the University of Queensland claims to have the answer. Dr. Brendan Zeech studied the average time hundreds of couples have intercourse from all different countries around the world with the aid of a stopwatch. His results were eye-opening. Some countries enjoyed shorter romps, while others recorded longer intimate times. So how long do sex sessions normally last? Can you guess the bedroom buzzer? So Molly, this is a health show. Okay. And we've always talked about how important sex is to overall yes. good health. Gonna put you on the spot. In this study, She's what do you think the average time was for a sexual intercourse session? I would say... How long is it for you? <laughs> Say four hours, please. <laughs> I, I will say. I will say Molly, this. I'll, I'll sounds, take one hour. The average. The, I would say the like, average sounds too short to me. That's I, just. I would say like. You can say it. A number. It doesn't reflect anybody. Twenty-five minutes. Okay. That's not a bad run. Twenty. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow, Molly. Uh, the have... average time, five minutes and four seconds. <laughs> I thought, it, I thought it was short, too. Hey, and, uh... That's too short. Wait, really? It's five minutes? Yeah. yeah. Five minutes, four seconds. Well, five minutes, I mean, four we seconds. Know, we, we know what those last four seconds are. <laughs> Hold on, honey! <laughs> or don't move! I mean, five, you know what? You know, it's a 20-minute nap. I love that Molly's answer was the average, the average session. Yeah. Like 25 20, minutes? 20, 20 you must have an awesome husband. Yes. <laughs> I have a good husband. Okay. I mean, I, I, and, and I, will, I will acknowledge that when, when we read these stats, it, it's surprising. But you have to understand, this includes anyone and everyone. This probably includes some of those, those quicker sessions. But here's what I would say. <laughs> well, you, you know, from, from this is not a, a medical children. commentary now. It's... It's also the quality that matters, well, right? It is. So it's not I just. Agree. Is I it 304 so. seconds? <laughs> Those 304 <laughs> seconds might be. I mean, you know, you really gotta, great. you got to get the motor running, so to speak. I mean, you got to warm things up a little bit. So, I mean. <laughs> The longer, the better. Oh, I think so. I we can't just, know, we can't go that. from zero to 60. Well, in a, I included that in my time. But, but <laughs> like those, I included but that. those 25, 25 minutes, but I like that. I like, like that number. I have to know, say, I think. can't stay focused what's the, No, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at five <laughs> minutes and I'm thinking, what's the rush, everyone? You know, this is fun. Let's, let's, like five minutes, let's keep it going. Provided you can get it going, yes. I mean, that is an issue. <laughs> but. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, yes. <laughs> Provided you can get and it going, as you get all, you, you have a tendency to, to last longer, like compared well, to. Well, and a lot of women have difficulty reaching orgasm, so it might be five minutes, four seconds for the man, and at that point, the woman's like, forget it, I'm just yes. it's not going to happen. <laughs> Now, premature ejaculation is the most common male sexual dysfunction. It's a legitimate problem for a lot of men out there. And so while we're having fun with this, obviously, if you're someone who feel, feels like you suffer from that, um, it's worth getting an evaluation. Not everyone can be Drew or Molly. And, you know, but last but not least, would you two ladies agree with this? What? The longer the foreplay, the better the... Oh, hell main event, no, right? Absolutely. Because I think you, I don't know, as a woman, it's like, and now that I'm, I'm a mom and I'm like, the time that like I have, it's so like, you have it's, to make it count. You have to make it count. Like, I have to like plan with my husband to go on a date or to have dinner by ourselves or just to have that little bit of extra time. And I, it does make a difference. It makes a difference in my marriage. Well, and it's, it's so very important.